Yeah, wonderful people, viewers, and subscribers. Ha, Nigeria will not enter one chance so because this so called temporal, because I believe it is temporal, temporal presidency of uh, Bola Ahmed Tinubu is now a family affair. <laughs> As his daughter has come to declare herself the Yoloja of uh, Nigeria before she was the Yoloja of uh, Lagos State, but now the whole of Nigeria, meaning that every market in Nigeria is now under her control. But Mikuna bring them um, down. Eh? Take Kuna eyes, see what Arise Television came up with. My father is now the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, and the, 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 I, I need to help him in my own way. Now, you know, connecting to the people, seeking people's opinion, getting information from the people how they are, then processing it and taking it back to the system that these are the areas we will want you, the people want you to do something. It's not just my responsibility alone. We, the women, youth, we need to work together and stand up to the government that, you know, they've promised this and it is very important for us to achieve it. So we will not relent in our effort, calling the attention of the government that ensuring that all the promises made is being kept. Because she was before the general yeah, of Lagos, of so Lagos, now she's yes. she speaking in her capacity. Promoted herself. Yes, she has promoted herself. And by the way, um, OG, and that is before, present. yeah, and you heard that in her statement. Mm. Yes. Before the um, inauguration, she had a pre-inauguration dinner as well for okay. her people. And then she also had a dinner with friends of the Yaloja Initiative where she had some speakers come. She said she wanted to focus on women and youths. I just wonder what the First Lady would do in this instance. I don't know how they you know, usually the, um, the First Lady would take on yeah. certain CSO roles. But when, when you look at things like this, a few days back, Oji, we're still arguing about the role of the First Lady, whether it's constitutional or not. And now we have to grapple first with daughter. the idea of a first daughter yeah. and perhaps a first son. Son, yes. It, it's coming very soon. It's a waste of, it, it's an abuse of power in the first instance. The first thing I just want to say very quickly is that I think the president should call his family to order. We need to, there's a lot of work to be done and we shouldn't be spending time talking about the daughter of the president saying that she has to advise. Advise him in your family meetings, in your sitting room and not bring it to the public and, and, be, and, and make Nigerians upset by putting firstly, first I daughter of the of Nigeria. I would, like, I would like to disagree with you. <laughs> you can't tell, you can't tell us how we are going to run our lives. Please. Okay. <laughs> All right? Okay. When my father was giving birth to me as the first daughter, <laughs> you were not there. Oh, you're speaking so up for her. Wait, wait, wait. I, I got, so please, please know your level. All right. So All right. Please. So okay. I am, as I am speaking my please know your level. Please, do you, do you know how long it took my father to be able to be president? <laughs> All right, we're fine. The violence is a lot. <laughs> All right, let's Stay talk. Stay in your place, Ayo. <laughs> nah, man. Honestly speaking, this one, eh? This one, this one shocked me to see this kind of um, madness. You see, this level of desperation we are seeing in this country. And this uh, family affairs. In fact, that advice by this um, lady on um, Arise is the top notch. Honestly, you want to advise and help your father. Make you carry and go family meeting. No carry and rob for Nigerian people for face. We are dealing with um, the one of face. Lady is one. Oh God, this is the height of it, man. Very soon, the I know this first son is also <laughs> preparing his own office, and maybe first grandchildren. And all of those things. And uh, some first in laws will start coming up too. <laughs> These people, eh? Hey! Well, all of this is temporary. I can tell you, Nigerians, and I can show you that this will not take too long. These people will not succeed. To be honest with you, if there is anything justice, anything called justice, this madness will not stay too long. Let me just keep it at this. I'll keep bringing you more updates as we continue to enlighten the public on good governance. I'm only a voice. Help me share this video. And let's have your thoughts on this. What do you think about this? Bye-bye for now.